Hello and welcome. Today I am going to be turning a rabbit cage into a hamster cage. Now, how I did this was me and my dad, we just bought a roll of mesh and we cut it to the sides of, for the sides of the rabbit cage and we just zip tied them on and we had like these clippy things to clip it. So the things you'll need is zip ties, mesh, and something to um, cut the mesh with and you can do this. I'm not very good at just describing it, so you're going to have to actually watch the video to understand what to do. So yeah, let's get right into the video. So, hello everyone. I forgot to film, but I have so far gotten one side down. Um, so, I have zip tied it and we cut it to size. And we have another piece right there which I'm going to cut for there and then we will cut it so we can access the huge um, opening. It's just because it's foldable and so we can fold it if we don't use it and oh gosh. Hello Logan. Not me. Not right now. Bye bye Logan. Um, so that's the first bars or things we got. Um, First I fold it and then I put it to size, which I cannot do I have the camera. Now that I have zip tied it here, I'm going to zip tie it all the way around on every like these thingies. And yeah. Okay, so it's the next day because I was way too tired. We started really late. So I got everything around it, but I got this side too. And I just have to cut right there. Um, later we're gonna be going to buy more zip, zip ties because we ran out. So, there was already some mesh on here and my dad just took it and bent it and then we zip tied it. So we just zip tied this long piece of mesh and we just have to put another strand here and we also have to cut out the door here. And then he just is going to cut this out because I can't cut, he, 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 sharp ends happen if I cut it. So we're going to cut this and I will zip tie it and do it properly because before I wasn't zip tying it properly. And you're sitting there laughing at me, <laughs> even though he didn't even tell me that you're supposed to do a zip tie a certain way. I just assumed you just stick it through it and it only goes through one side. No. Yeah. And tomorrow we're going to go get the hamster. I don't know. Right? We're going to go tomorrow? Yeah. And while he's doing that, I think I'm actually going to go get the base and clean it. We are then going to clip around the lid so that we can take that mesh and zip tie it to the lid and get the lids to work. We have wiped this with the uh, Lysol wipes just because there's a whole bunch of gross stuff on it. We're just going to wipe it down to dry it. So there we go. It was really gross before. So there we go. I'm now going to take some we're going to take some water and vinegar and then paper towels, but first I'm going to spray this. And we're going to take more paper towels and just now get everything out. So here's the finished cage. I'm going to post a part two. Um, so the first, this, this video is making the cage and just how I meshed it and stuff and the second cage is going to be getting my hamster so I guess you get a little sneak peek of what how I set it up but this is what it looks like at the very end we didn't end up cutting here we just used the door at the top but yeah 